Officers responding to emergencies and solving crimes need the right tools. And now the Portsmouth Police Department has new and improved gear to help protect their police dogs. News 3 reporter Angela Bohan introduces us to these police canines as they show off new protective vests and some of their skills. This is canine officer Ace with his handler, Officer McDonald. He's showing off his skills, wasting no time finding a narcotics decoy hidden in a suitcase. He and his fellow Portsmouth police canines are sporting new custom fitted ballistic vests paid for by local real estate developer, the Breeden Company. They donated $20,000 for the vest, not only to the Portsmouth Police Department, but also to Virginia Beach and Norfolk Police Departments. The CEO told me that taking care of animals is a passion of their founder, and the news of a police dog being killed in the line of duty in Norfolk back in 2016 sparked his motivation. One of the canines were, was killed on duty and did not have a bulletproof vest. And so Ray said, look, we've, we've got to do something about that. And so he has always made the point, there is no one taking care, an animal cannot take care of itself. And as much as you or I may want to pet these canines, their handlers want to remind everyone for safety purposes, you never want to go up and pet a police dog. They are working and an important job at that. Each of the six Portsmouth K-9 officers now have two custom-fitted ballistic vests, helping keep them safe when performing narcotic searches like you saw Ace do, or detecting explosives, finding evidence at crime scenes, even searching for a missing person. Each canine is a beloved member of the Portsmouth Police Department family, and we want to make sure that they're safe and protected. We're really grateful to them for providing us with this funding. It'll help us further protect our canines. In Portsmouth, Angela Bohan, News 3.